exclusive live radar tracking storms so you'll know first. This is WVTM 13 weather. Well, it's been another hot, humid day, but this time around, we've actually seen decent coverage of those pop-up showers and thunderstorms through the afternoon, now pushing into the early evening. WVTM 13 Live Doppler showing that the overall coverage of rain now, not as high as it was maybe two hours ago, but certainly some heavy downpours still occurring. Strongest storm right now on the map. It's basically pushing into the Pickens side of the Tuscaloosa Pickens County line north of Gordo, east of Reform. Uh, it looks like some lightning, obviously, some heavy rain, maybe some gusty winds in that storm. Also, we may see a couple more between now and sundown, but I think by the time we reach nine this evening, most if not all of us will be dry. It's very hot where it's not raining. 92 Birmingham, 88 Gadsden, 89 Clanton, 93 degrees in Haleyville. We'll do it all over again tomorrow. Heat advisory in effect for all of central Alabama. The heat index will top out above 105 in many places mid to late afternoon. It's 96. That's the high temperature forecast for tomorrow in Leeds, Gadsden, 94, Aniston, 93, Clinton, 96 degrees in Tuscaloosa. But you can clearly see here compared to the last few days, much better coverage of rain and thunderstorms out there. Of course, not everyone's seeing the rain. In fact, more places not seeing rain than seeing rain. There were some noisy thunderstorms earlier across the Birmingham metro area, but not all areas saw the rain from those storms. We'll quiet down this evening overnight tonight, dry tomorrow morning, dry tomorrow afternoon. Just like today, we'll see more of those widely scattered hit or miss pop up showers and thunderstorms. A little more moisture around for today, tomorrow and again on Sunday. You can see that in the shades of yellow and orange that provides the better chance for those pop up storms. Uh, but look what happens Monday and Tuesday. The drier air shaded in blue quickly returns and that's going to put a temporary end to those rain chances to start the week. We will see rain chances return though for the second half of next week. And our seven day forecast showing a very hot, humid weekend. Outdoor plans, you should be okay in the morning, but in the afternoons, keep an eye on the sky. Of course, download that WVTM 13 app so you can watch uh, the live Doppler. Uh, our first part of next week is dry and very hot, a little less humid. Second half of the week, still hot, more humid and a chance for pop-up storms. Brittany. Adrian, thank you. Uh, 